Creating an edge fillets variable tab. Let's go up and select a fillet. And let's go and pick on the variable tab. In the variable tab, it says, you know, the select an edge. I'll come over here and select this edge. Boom. Now, from one side to the other, it has a start and an end radius. So over here, I'm going to change my end radius. I'm going to make it 0 0.60. And you'll see that on this end, it's 0.25 a radius. Over here, it's 0 0.60 as a radius. Uh, and I can get those over here as well. And so I can, uh, I can accept that if I want. Um, but let's take a look at a couple other things. Over here, I can make it a tangent radius, or I can make it a G2 radius. And a tangent radius is going to have a, a machined edge that I could be able to see real well, is where a G2 will make it very smooth. So let's first put the tangent on there, and I'll hit Apply. And boom. You can have a little bit. You can see where that machined edge runs right along there. And now I'm going to back that up. And when I undo it, and I'm going to do a fillet. I'm going to go to variable. I'm going to select that edge again. I'm going to pick the end of being 0.620. Same thing. And this time, let's go with the smooth G2 fillet. I'm going to hit apply. And I'm going to close this. And now, it just blends very smoothly in there. It's hard to even see where it ends at visually. Um, so it just smooths in there so much better. So um, now if I want to edit that again, all right, I can just come up here and uh, I can say, uh, so let's do this. Let's go over uh, to the fillet and I can say edit feature. And in here I can make changes. Uh, so we might want to take a look and say, oh, maybe this was supposed to go all the way to the edge. And I can come back in here and I can make that change to 0.75. And I can say OK. And boom, now I got a smooth transition right up to the edge of the part. So the variable is made, uh, a fillet is so that it changes its radius from one end to the other on the fillet. So uh, these are a little more, more expensive to do than a constant, um, but it is something that we have the possibility of doing uh, as well. I can also go back to the fillet and I can say let's edit the feature and in here then uh, I can I got some extra things down here I can set right and uh, let's see I can also do more than one edge if I like I'm like I can come over here and add and I can come in here and pick on this one and I can say this is really the start is down here I can pick and let's say I want the same type of thing to happen here 6.2 uh, oop I got the wrong way um, let's say I wanted this one to be that we had 0.25 and this one to be 6 yeah, sorry uh, 0.25 and this one I wanted actually 6 -0. there we go and uh, then I can come over, I can use my marking menus as well, right? I can say OK. And now I created two of them that have a variable uh, fillet.